Hey everybody, Scott Spritzer here, DocSports.com, and welcome to the update for Friday, December 6, 2019. Got a free pick coming up in just a moment. First, a quick note, if you have yet to become a member over at DocSports.com, real cool way to give it a trial run. Click on that link below the video, get set up for a free $60 account. Use those free 60 bucks on any of my daily packages, and you get the DocSports guarantee. It's as simple as that. Free trial run, $60 free account, the guarantee, and it's all available. All you got to do is click on the link uh, below this video to get started. Last night, a free pick winner here. We start off the new football week with the over between the Cowboys and the Bears, and that one cashed. And listen, we've still got our entire premium picks card in College of Pro Football for the weekend, available right now over at DocSports.com. And for just the second time this season, I've got a seven unit, a six unit, and a five unit play. Three elite plays in College of Pro Football in the same weekend, all available right now as part of this package. And it all starts with Friday night football. The Pac-12 championship tonight between Oregon and Utah is one of those three elite level plays. Six unit play, you don't want to miss out. We're on a 29 and 18 run that's over 60% winners now heading to the seventh week of this run. Six weeks in the books. Number uh, Week number seven coming up this week starts tonight on Friday. All the football plays for the weekend right through Sunday night football, which we're in action in, uh, are available right now over at DocSports.com. You can go grab them. College football Football, NFL, seven unit, six unit, five unit. The six unit goes tonight, Oregon and Utah doing battle for the Pac-12 title. Uh, also wanted to mention we've got two college basketball plays for Friday. Those will be posted at 11.30 a.m. Eastern, 8.30 a.m. Pacific. Grab it anytime after 11.30 Eastern. NBA and NHL at 1 p.m. Eastern time. We're hitting about 59% on our current run in college baskets. NHL 60% for the season despite dropping one last night with Montreal. But again, we have all the plays going in basketball and NHL per usual at their normal times on Friday Sports.com. College and Pro Football Weekend. You can go grab it right now as we speak. Before I get to the free pick for Friday, a real quick note on some of the betting reports. We get these from William Hill, the gang over there. We appreciate them sending them to us. But for instance, last night, Thursday Night Football, William Hill showed 70% of the spread tickets on the Dallas Cowboys. Make that 76% of the spread tickets were on the Dallas Cowboys. 57% of the spread money was on the Dallas Cowboys. So uh, William Hill, I guess, would have to have done pretty well there as far as the side was concerned. They did get hit by 58% of the money line tickets on the Chicago Bears, which was around plus a buck 45, uh, but they did get 80% of the money on the money line on Dallas. As far as the over-under was concerned, as you know, here our free pick was the over and it cashed. Well, they took 55% of the tickets on the under, 76% of the money on the total came under. As far as this weekend's college football, uh, the update, the betting report, just looking right now at some of the games. You've got, for instance, Miami Ohio taking on Central Michigan Saturday in the MAC Championship. And you're looking at over 80% of the tickets and the money on Central Michigan. They're laying six and a half. Other notable games uh, and, and, and best, basically betting reports with overwhelming support on one side. 75% of the tickets are on Appalachian State. They're laying six to Louisiana Lafayette. 81% of the money on App State. These are, of course, William Hill numbers and tickets and reports. Florida Atlantic. 80% of the tickets on Florida Atlantic lay an eight to UAB, 91% of the money so far on FAU. I mean, it's one side after a game after another. And, and you look at Baylor getting the money in the tickets, Cincinnati and their game against Memphis, they are getting uh, more of the tickets, more of the money right down the line. Boise State, over 70% of the tickets and the money against the spread in their game against Hawaii. LSU getting 80% of the tickets, over 65% of the money against Georgia, Ohio State overwhelming bet at William Hill. Over 80% of the tickets, over 90% of the money in their game against Wisconsin. The Buckeyes lay in 16 and a half. And Clemson, basically money-wise, just over half of the money has come in on Clemson and about 60% of the tickets. Again, these numbers at William Hill, which of course includes Indiana, Iowa, Nevada, New Jersey, West Virginia. So uh, again, you're seeing a lot of one-sided action. Hardly any of the Joes versus Pros variety in this weekend's college football. And 
as we get these numbers, we'll look to update them for you going into Saturday's card with our Saturday morning video, which by the way, uh, I'll put that up by 10 p.m. Pacific, no later than that, on Friday night for Saturday's card. Real quick mention, we are back in fight action for Saturday. Our uh, plays will be posted at DocSports.com by 10 p.m. Pacific Friday night for Saturday's card. We might throw a boxing over under, a boxing total into the mix for Saturday. We'll definitely have at least one UFC fight from Saturday's card. That'll all be available at DocSports.com by 10 p.m. Pacific on Friday night for Saturday's card. All right, let's get to our free pick for tonight. We turn to NBA action. And let me get the current line here for you. I want to give you exactly uh, what we have here. And it's Brooklyn laying two and a half. One book has three. I've got about 18 books on my screen, by the way. One book has three, and the rest have two and a half. And we're going to recommend laying that two and a half points with the Brooklyn Nets over Charlotte. Uh, Brooklyn just won a matchup with Charlotte just a couple of weeks ago in Brooklyn. And, and the Nets were able to get that win despite not shooting all that well. I mean, they were bad from the three-point line. Field goal shooting was nothing to write home about. Uh, they had one fewer made free throw than did Charlotte, but they still won the game 101-91. to Played solid defense in that contest. I expect more of the same here, at least from Brooklyn on the defensive end, and they ought to be a little bit hotter shooting the basketball. And we like them to get the win laying two and a half. They've won four of the last five on the road outright, so we're not worried about them uh, being on the road here against Charlotte. We're going to back and recommend a play. Free pick on the Brooklyn Nets minus the points over Charlotte on Friday. Again, check it out. College football, NFL, entire weekend starting with that elite level six unit play. Friday night's Pac-12 championship right through the weekend. Available right now at DocSports.com. Go grab it. If you like these videos, click on that thumbs up button. Be sure to uh, subscribe. We do appreciate those who have done so thus far. I'm Scott Spritzer. Let's put Friday in the win column over at DocSports.com and I'll be right back here Friday night by 10 p.m. Pacific with another play from Saturday. We'll talk to you then.